Hi folks, today's tutorial is going to be about our sign plate. This is our 6 inch by 6 inch, so we call it a, a SP66, and about the magnetic chuck. The advantage that we have with our sign plate, uh, in this case it's a 5 inch, that means the center distance from the roll to this roll happens to be 5 inches. And that's very accurate within a couple of tenths. One of the features that I'd like to explain is that, first of all, it's a part of our sign set system, which means other tools that we make, a V-block, index fixture, the magnetic chuck, and many other items, all bolt on, including an angle plate. What else do we have? Let's see, we got a whole bunch of things. Anyway, they all bolt on here. One of the features that we like is that if you need to drop a rail down, or what a stop as we call it, it's easy enough to do. You don't have to remove it. You just loosen the two screws right here and drop it down. Or if you want to engage it, lift it up, snug it down, and you're ready to go. Now let's say you want to check an angle that happens to be 15 degrees and 8 minutes. Well, the way to do that, there's two ways. One is to go to our website at subtool.com. The other one is to look in a uh, one of our books that we'll be glad to send to you uh, that has all the sign settings in it and it shows 3 inch and 5 inch uh, and it goes all the way through in fact it even has metric in here for millimeters 100 millimeter and I think uh, 125 millimeter so looking in the book let's say we wanted 15 degrees 10 minutes and 12 seconds uh, here it is in the book it says 5 inches you find it here and pull the gauge box that you need. And I'm just going to give you a sample. And let's say that we needed to pull, uh, uh, let's say we needed to pull gauge blocks for 15 degrees. We were going to take the gauge blocks and we're going to ring them together like such. Going to set it down here. Make sure you wipe everything good and clean. It's always when you're working in close tolerances, everything has to be as clean as possible. You can't make it too clean. So now we've got it set. There's a locking strap here, and one of the features that we have also is that the strap never protrudes above the surface of the sign plate, which is an important feature. Otherwise, uh, we've seen some of the imports, they protrude, and you're liable to accidentally set it on top of it, not know that you're down on, on the surface of the plate. Uh, because uh, the locking strap is interfering with it. The other feature that we have is that we also offer a magnetic chuck. The magnetic chuck itself can be used independently of the sign plate. Why would you want to do that? Well, let's supposing that you wanted to grind something on a surface grinder, you wanted to check it, and it had something that overhung on one end. You could set it on there and let it hang over. The other thing you can do is you can use this as what we call a squaring chuck. You can set it on its side. It's accurate within two tenths in any one of these directions. You can remove the rail, set it on that side, set it on this side, put your part on there, put the magnetic, uh, engage the magnetic chuck by turning it on here, and you're ready to go for either inspection or for grinding. But here's an important feature. There are holes down here that you can see that are threaded, and there are recessed holes in the sign plate right here on these four, these four holes right here. You can take this, the magnetic chuck and you can set it on top of the sign plate, register it against both sides, which gives you registration within a couple of tenths. On the bottom, you lift it up and insert four bolts, snug it down, now you've got a magnetic sign plate. So, in some cases, you might want to say, well, I want to buy a magnetic sign plate, and you, need, and, and you want a regular sign plate. You've got two separate tools. Here, you've got three separate tools, but you're only making one purchase. You buy the chuck and the sign plate combination. Now you've got three tools in one. You can use the chuck by itself. You can use the sign plate by itself, or you can use it as a combination. One of the design features that we came up with many years ago to save toolmakers time. Thank you for watching.